Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Simply Stuff. That's me. So in today's video, we have like a miracle. Um, this very rarely happens. As a matter of fact, I don't remember when it happened ever, honestly. Um, both my Ipsy and my BoxyCharm that cost exactly the same amount came at the sa on the same day. So we are going to, I figured, why not take the opportunity and like, you know, it's a special occasion, so why not do this? battle of the boxes okay they both are exactly the same price because they're $25 and then there's tax included so again let's see which box is better now I am a little stumped about this box but we'll get into that more in the video so if you want to see which box is the better value then keep on watching Hey guys, remember, please subscribe and give the video a thumbs up. Thank you. So hey guys, listen, I just wanted to comment really quickly before this video starts. Watch the lights in the background. I swear I'm haunted. I have not touched them. I do have a remote for them, but I don't have the remote anywhere near me. And I did not, absolutely did not touch them while I was recording this video. But they keep going from unblinking and right now I'm sitting here while I'm recording they're not blinking they're on straight boom and they're not on a timer I mean you know they're just plain they're not blinking but watch the video every now and then they just start to go crazy for some reason and I swear I told you guys before I think my house is haunted well just keep an eye out during the video and see what I'm talking about all right so into the video we go Okay, guys, so like I said, oh, and listen, this whole thing out in the hot, it is so humid. It went nothing I can do. That's why my hair is up. It's not because of it's a heck of a day, but because I just didn't know what else to do. It was too hot. So, all right, so we do have BoxyCharm and Ipsy. I'm going to go ahead and do BoxyCharm first. So, I, the size is weird. Like last month, it came in, like, a, I couldn't tell the difference between the premium which I do have so that'll be the next video but I figured why not let's go ahead and this never really happens to me at least I can't remember where is okay here. Um, so yeah so let's go ahead and break on into this BoxyCharm base box if you don't know what BoxyCharm is it is a uh, makeup subscription they have three tiers well, that's, uh, 25 is the base box that's what I call it and that's this one that's five full size products and there's tax included shipping is free they have premium which is 35 you get six to seven products although I don't believe I've ever gotten seven products um, at, again taxes in, um, in my state there's tax and shipping is free so it's just $35 plus tax and then uh, every three months they have what's called the uh, Lux box and that I believe is somewhere around $50 it's a uh, I have to, I'll link everything down below, so no worries on that. Okay, so again, BoxyCharm base box, twenty-five dollars, and I'll, like I said, I'll leave a link so you can, uh, if you want to sign up, you can. So I'm gonna open it up, and the first thing I see is, oh my God, thank you, yes, a car. <laughs> I'm so happy I have my phone set up, ready to go to look through these things, so that it's less added, editing. I want to get this up on the day that I record it, which is Friday. So hopefully, you guys will see this tonight. All right, so. Again, this is what I see. I have no idea what's in this in this box. I haven't looked. Now, I have watched some unboxings, but again, you could watch every one and not see the same box twice. Um, the theme of the BoxyCharm this month for July is sunshine. There you go, if you can see that. I have to get used to this camera, guys, again. And I have variation, oh my gosh, 66. Oh, and it does have the prices and the the um, items here, but there's there's a variation number right there if you can see it. Wow, higher and higher every month. Okay, so the first thing I'm seeing here, now I do know one product because I picked it, I believe. Um, the choices were eh, you know what I mean? But I, I, if this is really the product, then I'm happy to get it. But anyway, the top of my head is cut off, guys, because there's nothing I can do. It's just so high. My hair is just so... Ow, ow, way up there. Anyway, okay, so the first thing is what I picked, all right? So we'll do that first. This is, um, this is, okay, wait, glasses, yeah, uh-huh, I know, okay. Oh, and if you're wondering, I just did like a quick, because of being so hot, I didn't 
try to put a whole bunch of ton, like tons of makeup on. I uh, use the Tati palette for a really quick look. Um, I do have those lashes that we got in, in Bijou, and I like them. They were so easy to go on, boom, boom, and they're really comfortable. Okay, but they're like really floofy. <laughs> but okay, so glasses on. Oh, they're so dirty. What? Anyway, we're gonna have to like push through. All right. So the first product I see here is one 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 skin. There it is in the box. Um, I'll go ahead and take it out. Now this is the item that I picked. This was from Choice. I didn't pick the premium choice because I forgot about it, and um, I was <laughs> lucky with everything going on. I was amazed that I picked this product anyway. You know what I mean? But um, okay, so here's what it looks like out of the packaging, and. I am a huge fan of 111 Skin. They are an extremely pricey uh, brand, but I anything I've ever tried from them, I've liked. So, okay, so this is 111 Skin. This is the NAC Y2 Pollution Defense Booster. Sorry, a daytime booster to fortify your skin against the harmful aggressors of the digital age. Okay, this unique booster shields the skin against physical and blue light pollution. Through a powerful combination of peptides and antioxidants. <laughs> the manufacturer retail price of this product is $135. So, this box, when you get five products, is guaranteed value of $125 or more. Okay? So, right there, we're above. So, in my mind, I'm thinking, well, the stuff I'm getting, extra stuff I'm getting, is not going to be all that expensive and, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, there you go. You have that. And this is just a serum. I'll quickly go ahead and show you. I'm not going to spend tons of time on this, guys. I don't know if you can even see that. Let's see. Let me spread it out. Uh, my light is all the way up, too. But it, you can just see that little glow there. It goes on. Let me see. it, And it looks like it soaks right in, which that's awesome. So, again, I really, really like this brand. I'm going to do some checking on the site and it's, there's no smell to it and it does it does go in quite nicely it it's a little sticky but not like crazy nothing crazy like like a moisturizer or a serum so there which it is so <laughs> that makes sense okay so there you have it all right that's the first product again that wipes out the price of the box so I'm not expecting too much more after that that's just me you know love hate relationship box drop. okay so um Okay, so the next thing I'm pulling... Here, let me just go ahead and go through this. This is the Ace... Okay, let me take it out the bubble wrap. This is the Ace Butte uh, Bronzed in Paradise palette. The Bronzed in Paradise Bronzer palette... Oh, okay, that's a tongue twister. The Bronzed in Paradise Bronzer palette <laughs> is an addition to the much-loved Paradise Collection. Four bronzer shades are featured to provide a natural sun-kissed look. Can be layered on top of liquid cream or other powder complexion products. Okay, so let's take a look at that. There is a mirror. So I'm going to go ahead and hold it up like this. I mean, there's the mirror, guys, okay? And those are the shades. And I'm guessing these are matte, okay, which is what I, I absolutely love. I do have the Benefit Huda for bronzer, but that's a little too orange for me. These shades, I mean, if I go light-handed, I've seen the unboxings of this, and they're pretty pigmented. So I think I would get away with this one, maybe, if I go very light-handed. And if I wanted to contour, these are just a little too red for me. I don't think with my complexion it would look good. Um, but again, like, I could pop an eye, you know, as, as maybe a transition. Because you don't need to just use these as bronzers. You can use eye, you know, eyeshadows, whatever. But, um, yeah, I would get away with this one, I think. So that's cool. I, I do like Ace Butte, I've, or Butte, however you say it. Um, I've had, I have a couple, quite a few of their eyeshadow palettes, and I've never had an issue with them. Always go on nice, pigmented, you know, never patchy or anything. So that's a good thing. All right, well, I'm happy about that. Okay, so that's two out of the five. I'm good. Okay, the next thing I see here is... This is Studio Makeup Endurance Cream Shadow. and it, Okay, and that's what it looks like right there. And the shade is um, S-E-S, <laughs> -E I'm sorry, S-C-S, -S, I think it says 10 Gold. There it is, if you can make it out on the end of that, I don't know. And this is a 
Let me read about this. Hold on one second. Okay, Studio Makeup Endurance Cream Eyeshadow. There it is there. Uh, oops. <laughs> it says, get both shimmer and shine with this cream eyeshadow. This lightweight, decadent formula is the perfect addition to your glow. Apply a sheer layer for a soft and radiant daytime appearance or add a few layers for a dramatic evening glow. Okay, so this is valued at $25. Now, I don't know if I would pay $20, $25 for a liquid eyeshadow and a bitty bitty one at that. Um, and I didn't tell you how much this was. I'm sorry. The Ace Butte um, Bronze Paradise, Bronze in Paradise palette is worth 30 to, um, retail value is $30. And this one, again, is 25 Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and swatch it really quickly. No, you know what? I'm not going to because I'm probably going to end up putting this in the giveaway, guys. I have a lot of um, cream shadows, and I do have this kind of color. so, and, and I don't use them a ton, so I don't really need, like, triples. and You know what I mean? So this will go in the giveaway box there. Okay, so this big old thing right here. This is, okay, all right. Th wow. Okay, I'm... Okay, all right. I'm okay. I'll tell you at the end of this thing. This is Grace and Stella anti wrinkled and energizing eye mask. Twelve pairs. Okay, this is what it looks like here. Now, I'm not gonna open open the package, but I am gonna just show you. And you know, the eye patches are the ones that go under here. I use them all the time. I absolutely love them. I have uh, what is it? Um, uh, good genes or good molecules, I think it is, the 1% caffeine in the fridge that I use. I use them today. Anything to get help me get these dark circles from under my eyes, because I have them no matter how much. I can sleep 12 hours. I wake up, I have them. So um, I think it's because of the iron. I'm like iron deficiency, so hereditary, what have you. All right, so it says, Grace and Stella, it's like an energy drink for your eyes, which I'm liking that. Um, suffering from dark circles, that's me. Puffy eye bags, that's me again. Fine lines, you got it. <laughs> and general fatigue, boy, I'm going four for four. Um, around your eyes, that's me, yes. Perk them up as if you had, if you've just had eight hours of sleep. <laughs> well, okay, wow, okay, can I find the camera, please? I'm going to hold it back like this, guys. Um, yeah, it says, let me start that over. Perk them up as if you've just had eight hours of sleep with these eye masks. They re that revitalize and rejuvenate the tired eyes, leaving you looking more awake and youthful. Manufactured repel. Ugh. The value is twenty-one dollars. Holy smokes! Okay, so okay, so that's this, and that's all I see. But it says I have one more product. So how many products did I get? One, two. <laughs> okay, boxy charm, boxy charm. All right, guys, so I have this product that I showed you. I have this product that I showed you. And then this one and this one. So I have four products. That's all that came in the box. I don't see anything else. I mean, I don't think that I dropped it. Let me check before I start going on a rant. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, that's it. They kind of, I guess they forgot the fourth product. I'll have to email them and let them know. That it is not in here because that's all, that's it. That's everything that you can see. There's the three products right here. And then this one, of course, the Stella thing. This eye doohickey and then my uh, 111 skin and then that's it. So, all right. They must have forgot to put it in there, but it should be in here. And I will tell you what it is. It is the, oh, ah, glasses for this one. That print is too small. This is, it, what's supposed to be in here, what I should be holding up is the Dochi or Duchi, however you say that, Fire and Fine Graphic Pen, a deeply pigmented and waterproof graphic eyeliner that's easy and effortless to apply. The design of a felt tip applicator allows you to create either a thick or thin line depending on the amount of pressure used during application. Retail value $21. Well, that's not in here, so I have to get a hold of customer service and let them know that they forgot to put an item in my box. Okay, so... Just imagine that's in there. Now, you know how I am about eyeliners. I Please don't ever send me eyeliners. I have enough until, gosh, I could be reborn and have enough for that life, too. So, anyway, and that's not including the ones that are in the giveaway box, which is a ton of those, too. So, All right, so there you have it. Now, um, I will leave the retail value of the entire box here because it's not added up. But um, So that's Botsy Charms. So let's go ahead and get into my, sorry, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and see what we think about that. Now, I do need, unless, they don't normally have a, 
a card. So we're going to go ahead and um, I have my phone pulled up to, you know, where it says on the email, if you have, if you get Ipsy Glam Bag or Ipsy Glam Bag Plus or our Ultimate even, I think they tell you, you know what I mean? They give you a list of the items they're sending. So if you don't know about Ipsy, this is, this is Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I also get the Ipsy Glam Bag. That is here somewhere as well for July. And um, this one is, they have three subscription as well, just like BoxyCharm. Although, the only difference is um, you have the bag that is $12, and that's five sample size products, sometimes deluxe, sometimes full size, um, but mostly sample size. And then you have this one, which is $25. All of these have tax, okay? So the bag, the little one, uh, Miss Thing, Miss Thing wants to get up. She's, yeah. No, no, honey. Can, honey, can you grab her, please? The boyfriend's here. Hubby's here, and he needs, can you take her, please? Okay, sorry. Okay, so she was coming through the light. Anyway, um, yeah, so the the little bag one with the with the little samples or whatever, that's $12 plus tax. It's uh, $12.72. This is, I believe, comes to like $26.50 because this also has tax. It's $25. And then they have the Ipsy Ultimate, which is every month as well, and that's $50 plus tax. I do not do the Ultimate. I'm not a fan of that one. Um, I've never seen anything wow me, so... But, okay, so, again, Battle of the Boxes, right? Oh, come on, no, no. Carly's shaking the camera. No, Carly, no, no, honey. I don't want to, like, yell at her, you know, because she's sick, but... Okay, so, when you open the box, I did just cut it open. When you open the box, it says, Discover Yourself, and we have this nice, bright orange padding, and there it is. I'm not going to get excited about the, the card, because it never has a price in it anyway. And there I have it there. Okay, there's a peek. And, okay, so I have my trusty phone, which has my items that I'm supposed to receive this month. So I'm going to put that down there. You know what, I'm just going to take them all out because this box, I do not have a lot of room to work with, guys. I have so much stuff on my desk, it's crazy. Ah, and I just dropped something. I don't know what it was. Okay, <laughs> nothing that could have broke, I hope. All right, so... And then, of course, you have the, and this, this is, a, the, like I said, $25, and there's five full-size products. They're supposed to be anyway. And you do get a bag with each subscription. So, um, we'll go through that. Okay, so, Ipsy for the month of July. What are you sending me? Okay, let's go back to here. Okay, so, the first thing is the bag, all right? So, this is the bag, and it's kind of, like, see-through a little bit. Let me show you put my color switch in there and you can kind of like see through it if I mean I mean I can see th perfect you know through there but anyway you see how you can see through that so it is kind of thin but it does have this cute little airplane on it okay and the theme of this month for July is take a break and again it doesn't have any prices or anything so I don't know why they put this in here but okay um, and this says wanderlust and you have the little palm trees or whatever. And but I do like the, the little zipper. That's a little cute little detail there. So, okay, so that's the bag. Let me stick this over here. Um, let's see. So, in my glam bag, plus this month, I got the Seate London Watermelon Burst Hydrating Primer. Okay? I don't know the retail value. I don't think it says it here. Let's see. Maybe if I click on it, it will tell me. Um... Okay, so this is what it looks like, guys, right here. That I love Seattle Lending's packaging. This one's a little dinged up, but, you know, it's only the package, so. And I always rip it trying to open these things, I swear. So, oh, this is kind of cool. I like that. There you go. And I don't know if it's, I guess it's filled. They have to have a little part where you can squeeze out. But there you have it. Let me smell this. I want to smell it. Is it sealed? Oh, it's not. Oh, that's so cool. It comes with a pump. I'm gonna, I just wanna put a little tiny bit on my hand because I'm definitely gonna get use out of this. I wanna smell it. <laughs> my cat is, she, you know how she has the Pika, right? Well, she also likes boxes, you know every cat does, but she scratches the boxes like she's going to China, I don't know. Oh, it's nice, it has a very light, fresh scent. I can't say that it smells like watermelon, but. No, I, I, I mean, it's just, a, just a fresh scent. Um, okay, and it is a cleanser, so let me see what it says here about it. Uh, ref okay, here we go. Refreshing 
Refreshing, hydrating, and perfect under makeup. This multitasking... Oh, no, it's not a cleanser. I'm sorry. It's a primer. My bad. Um, this multitasking primer checks all of the right boxes. Get hydrated without feeling greasy with hyaluronic acid. It's basically a moisture magnet. Watermelon extract is packed with vitamin C and antioxidants, which help brighten and protect your skin. The unique serum-like texture grips onto foundation for long-lasting wear and flawless. Oh, it does have price. Manufactured retail price is $28. So I'm, I'm excited to try that. I mean, I use my um, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I, I swear by that. I mean, it literally takes the pores away right in front of my face. So, you know, there's that. But I'm always, you know, interested in trying another one. So that's cool. I'm happy about that. And then let me just back out of there again. Okay, so there we have that one. And let's see. And the next item that I... What is going on here? Oh, here it is. I was going to say another product missing? No. Okay, so this is the Il Maquillage. I think I'm saying that right. Um, I had gotten a lip... Oh, what was it? It was like a lip pen from them. You know, it was like a thinner lipstick and... Uh, I got it as a try and review product. They sent it to me. And then I got $20 if I reviewed it. And I bought uh, another one in a different shade. And I quite liked it. It was very nice. So um, that's this brand. And I do like the packaging if I can ever get this open. What is really going on? Oh, that's so cool. Okay, it's taped. That's why. <laughs> Should have known. Okay, so again, we have... Uh, hi, I think I need another razor. This one's like getting really dull. I can't open anything. Oh, that's so cool. They do have, let me tell you, when they sent that pen and it didn't, you know, I didn't buy it. They sent it to me. It was done in this, like, I don't know. They went over the top of the packaging and that's how they are with their brand. They're, everything they send is just gorgeously packed. So here's, here's how it, it, you can see it in the box, but then when you open it, it just slides open and you pull it out. I mean, that's awesome. I, I got to say. And then it's just very sleek. The whole, the whole brand is just very bougie. It just gives you that bougie feeling. Now, to be an Ipsy, I'm a little surprised, I must say, you know. But that's good, I guess, right? So, all right. So this, let's go ahead and read about this one, and I will tell you the price if I can open it. And let's see. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's just so nice. It's just, it's got a, it's, you hear that? That's so awesome. Okay, so there's the shade there it's not any mirror it's just a single shadow and it's just like a basic brown but it does have I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it I'm just gonna go in twice now their products are very you know from what I've tried of them I haven't tried everything but there's just it's just like a I don't know almost like a coppery bronzy type or brassy type uh, shimmer I don't know if you can see that and that, I did go in there twice. I mean, that's what it looks like. It's still on my finger a little bit. So it is quite nice. And it's very light. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking you could build it up at night if you want to go out. But that's a good thing for, like, during the day. Okay, so I'm happy about this. I mean, I do have a ton of browns, but, or, like, colors like this. But I don't have it from this brand. So that's awesome. Now, let's see what it says. I will take, keep it out of the package while I go over it. Oh, and this is in the color 959 News Flash. Um, color boss I don't know if that might be the Ooh, if I drop things one more time I swear my hands are just so dry I need to put some lotion on okay let me just wipe my fingers off really quick hang on one second guys all right guys sorry about that okay so um what were we doing with we this thing here I went ahead and wiped it off my finger alrighty so it says get ready for some makeup magic. This hybrid shadow glides on like a cream, blends like a liquid, and finishes like a powder. Um, Multi-dimensional and totally eye-catching, this metallic brown shade transitions perfectly from day to night. That's what I was saying. If you add more, I think you can definitely make this into a night. The buttery smooth pigment lasts for hours without creasing or fading and can be applied wet or dry. That's awesome. Um, probably, like I said, if you could wet this, it would probably go on really like, ah, you know what I mean? So, um, depending on the little, it says can be wet or dry depending on the level of color payoff you want. So, again, probably would be really popping if you wet it. Don't let this baby hide in the bottom of your makeup bag. <laughs> um, the retail value is $29 for one eyeshadow. I will say their brand is pretty, like, expensive. Now, they do have this program. I know for sure. I don't know if they still have it. They used to have it. I'm, I don't know. I haven't seen anything lately, although I haven't looked. 
You used to be able to pay a very small fee, like five dollars, to try take have them send it to you, plus shipping, of course, and then try it. And if you liked it, then you had to pay the rest of it. If not, you send it back. But I don't know if they still have that. This was just something they did when they first came out. I don't know if they have it anymore. I would have to look into it. But if um, if you want to check it out, but like I said, I'm a, I'll leave a link maybe down below or. You can just look up it on, on uh, Ipsy and find it, okay? So there's that one, all right? And again, I will leave the total of the box, you know, at the end of the video, and then you guys comment below which box you think is the best. Okay, so the next item is Pure Lease, which I'm happy about, because I do, I'm telling you, I have that watermelon um, gel cream, and I'm loving it. I put something really, like, very hydrating under it, and when I put it over there, it just like locks the moisture in. It's so great. I like it a lot and it smells wonderful. Okay, so this is, I always do that. I go take that. So here's the box, guys. I'm going to have to hold it back. I don't know why, you guys. I got to figure out this camera. I really do. So there it is. This is the Pure Lease Green Matcha, I'm sorry, Matcha Green Tea Antioxidant Priming Moisturizer. So I guess there's two primers in one box. That's kind of strange, but okay. Um, Let's see, let me click on the picture. Okay, here we go, boom. There it is, there it is. And then we could read about it. Let me take it out of the pack. Um, it says, okay, I'll, I'll get the price from here. I'll read the benefits on the, off the back, or maybe not. Okay, hold on. What am I doing here, what? I'm sorry guys, my phone is like just, I don't know what it's doing. <laughs> I don't think it knows what it's doing. Let me see, here we go. I'm supposed to click on that, right, okay. Now, it says match, uh, matcha green tea, antioxidant primer moisturizer, lightweight, oil-free, water cream, prime skin for makeup. Okay, why is that doing that? Okay, I don't understand what's going on here. I keep clicking on this item and oh, I can't read that little thing. Okay, hang, on, hang on, guys. Oh, my God. It's because my screen was cracked when I was tapping on the uh, primer. It was taking me to the... A different item okay so this says right here give your skin a tall drink of water before getting glam this lightweight moisturizer works all for all types of skin and is a summer makeup must-have the oil-free consistency glides onto skin and perfectly primes your face for foundation dewy skin FTW I don't know what that means okay <laughs> um, Green tea is naturally rich in antioxidants, which helps your skin ward off environmental damage. Uh, sensitive skin, no prob. This moisturizer is enhanced with white tea, vitamin E, and French marine plants that help soothe, nourish, and protect your skin. And that's great because I have sensitive skin. Um, this is, oh my God, right, manufacturing retail price, $45 mm -hmm, for 1.7 fluid ounces. So there you have it, guys. And it's packed to the top at least feels that way I would imagine it has a seal yes it does I am not going to open this only because I have so many other ones going on <sighs> so we'll just leave that here okay and then let's see back on out of here again and then I want to look at this now this has been like this is like a cult favorite I think I mean I've seen it everywhere everyone's always talking about it I really like Nikki tutorials I I simply I think that she's just great and you know with all everything surrounding her so what that's what I say so what let her live her life you know what I mean but um she did this collab with Ofra and I you know what I'm probably talking about it is the glazed donut highlighter that is a collab with that uh, with um with Ofra and here it is now I and all my years have never gotten this one so I'm excited to get this, even though I don't use highlighter that much. I do think that this would be an okay shade for me, as long as I go very light with it. So, yeah, I'm going to click on here, and I don't really want to swatch it because I already... Do highlighters go bad? I don't know. Comment below. Do they? Because <laughs> I don't really... I guess it's open. It doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and swatch it. Okay. This really quickly. Um, where are we at? Okay, that... There you go. Wow, that's... Wow, you can see that from all the way back here. Holy crap. Yeah, I, I, I must not... I better not use that much, but... Yeah, I kind of like that. Wow. Okay. It doesn't have a mirror, but that's okay. Yeah, I'm liking that. Okay. Yep, I'm definitely liking that. All right, so... Oh, 
Let's see what it says about this. Okay, uh, I'm sure you guys know already, probably better than I do. Get ready to glow. This powder highlighter created by makeup artist Nikki Tutorials uses frosty white pearl pigments to make skin look lit from within. It sure does. A little goes a long way, and they're not joking when I say that. Um, it says it's made with a special blend of liquid to bake technology to ensure maximum color and shimmer payoff. Yes, it's a powder highlighter formula, but the buttery texture blends just as well as a liquid or cream. And it is really soft, guys. It really is. So I'm sure you all know. Like I said, it's been around for a while. This retail value is for $30. Okay, so there you have that. That's the fourth product. And last but not least is... Oh, okay. I Remember I said I had a haul that I bought a bunch of stuff? Well, I don't know. I'm going to see in a minute. Nope, this is different. Okay, so... I'll, Boy, these things, okay, let me just, hang on a second, man. I just got to put it back in there because I always take it out of the package without showing you guys. I am out uh, rusty, I guess. I don't know. I get back in the swing of things. Okay, so this is from Culture Couture. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but this is what I picked. Okay, this is the product that I picked. And um, this is, this is a contour brush. And you can definitely see when I take it out. What is going on? Really? Okay, there. My phone, the screen is cracked, and it's just not responding. Okay, I have that highlighter everywhere. All right, so let me take it out of the box and show you guys. Check this out. I th And it does have a little sheath, but it's stuck in there because I put it back in. A little thing that goes over it. But now check that brush out, guys. I don't have anything like this. Now, I do have other brushes from here that I got in one of the hauls that I said. Remember I said I have boxes upon boxes? Well... Somewhere in there, amongst a whole bunch of other stuff, is a couple brushes from this, um, same, same line. And, yeah. So, yeah, it says it here. I mean, it does have some weight to it. These brushes are actually really nice. So, let me tell you what it says. It says, okay, it says, why you, why you will love this brush is because we consider this brush the contour de force of our brush collection. Okay, contour, contour de force, whatever that means. The uniquely shaped brush head right here is designed to perform three makeup moves, contouring, applying blush, and blending. Okay, use the shorter side to contour and the fluffy tip for swirling on blush. Okay, I guess, yeah, I guess that could be done because you see how it is kind of tapered? Not only is it slanted, but it's also tapered. So that's pretty cool. Um, the velvet matte finish handle, which is really nice, uh, means it's comfy to hold and gives you full control over your product. Okay, and they aren't kidding. Um, it's vegan and cruelty free, thank you Jesus, and it's $35 for one brush, <laughs> which I would never pay. So I'm glad I got in the subscription. Okay, so there you have it guys. And like I said, I will leave the total of this box right here. Um, so, what do you think, guys? We have the Boxy Charm and we have the Ipsy. Both cost the same price, both exactly the same price, and both come with five full size products. So, comment below if you had to choose, if the Lord came down and said you can only take one of these, which one would you go with? I already know which one I would do, but I'll save that for my pin comment or for when I comment back to you. <laughs> All right, guys. So. Listen, thank you for tuning in. If you are new here, please subscribe. Um, please remember to give the video a thumbs up. And I have so much catching up to do. I did do an unboxing. It, um, I went ahead and I did the Hank and Henry mystery box because it was killing me. I didn't know what was in it. And that was supposed to be for tonight. But these boxes came. So I was like, oh, no. Once in a lifetime, I'm going to go ahead and do the battle of boxes. So I kind of pushed that back. And that one will be for tomorrow. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. And as always, thank you so much for tuning in. Um, remember, if you guys are having a hard time, please don't suck it up like I did. Um, please check on someone if you haven't spoken to them. Crazy times, you know. And most of all, stay safe, okay? See ya. Thanks. Okay, guys, really quickly, after much deliberation and look, looking back and forth at all the products, um... I put the retail value of each, although the boxy charm is more in value, like monetary value, only three out of the five products I think I'll actually use. 
maybe. Um, pos definitely two, maybe three. However, the Ipsy, as you can tell, as you'll see, you know, you'll, as you saw, is less in monetary value, but I will use every single item. So that's a tough one. Um, I know what my answer would be uh, for this month anyway. So like I said, comment below.